Hey Math 43, Miss A here. Welcome to day one. I wanted to do a couple of housekeeping items and then answer a couple of questions that I've been receiving. So my first housekeeping item is that your tech survey is due tonight. You will find that in item 1.5 of this week's module. I really wanna see what our tech needs are so that I can get you those resources, hopefully the resources you need. Um, I would not recommend taking this class if you only had your phone. So, you know, if you need a laptop or a hotspot, and some of you guys have asked about printers, um, I want to try and help you with that. My other reminder is to schedule your Zoom meeting. You need to schedule the meeting in the Canvas scheduler, scheduler and then you need to attend the meeting. Um, and there are a lot of time slots still available, but they will run out Friday at 10 a.m., so make sure you sign up for your time slot. I have office hours tonight from 6 to 9 p.m. There's still plenty of time slots available, and it takes about 10 minutes, so if you have 10 minutes, pop in, well, schedule it, and then go ahead and pop into the meeting. I'm starting to grade assignments and, uh, you know, like the Zoom meeting, the text survey, the PDF file. And if you're receiving a grade that's not full credit and you want to resubmit it, as long as it's before the due date, you're more than welcome to. So, for example, a few folks have submitted their PDF file and they mistakenly put one page instead of two pages or, or the pages were out of order or something to that effect. And I sent that grade or that score back to them and it wasn't full credit. They're more than welcome to resubmit that because that assignment isn't due until Thursday. And technically, you could even resubmit it after the um, due date. It's just the late penalty will start kicking in then. Um, also, I want to make sure that we get the Remind app. You can find the class code on my syllabus, and it just it allows us to text each other and maintain each other's privacy, so we don't exchange phone numbers, but we can still text. And I'm just more likely to answer your question in a, in a more timely manner. If you email me, I'm still going to answer you. I will not ignore you. It's just that I always have my phone on me, and I'm not always at my computer. And a couple of questions I've received um, Frequently, um, I'm getting asked, do we have regularly scheduled Zoom meetings? No, this class is completely asynchronous. I will have office hours each at, at certain times each week, same times each week, and that could be synchronous if you had a question. And I would always recommend pop into office hours if you have a question. Learning online is tough, all right? We've been in it for a year, and I, I mean, I think most of us would agree, especially for math, it's better in person. Or at least how about that's how I feel. So I would really recommend if you have a question, come to office hours and get it answered. I am here to help you and I totally want to. Uh, I, I actually love when students come to office hours. Otherwise, my office hours are kind of boring. I mean, I always have work to do, but I would so much sooner work with you. So pop into those whenever you have a question. And then the other question I'm getting is about printers. Are we required to have a printer? The answer is no. You, you might prefer to have a printer. And I, I'm a little older. I'm in my 40s. I, I need to print things out so I can write on them. Like It's just how my brain works better. But figure out what works for you. If you're fine doing everything on a notebook or on a tablet, that's great. So I just want you to hear it's not required. All right, that's what I got for today. So get that tech survey done fill out or make schedule your Zoom appointment and get that Remind app. And if you have any questions, give me a shout. Um, and I'm just I'm thrilled you're here, all right? And it's been lovely meeting everyone on Zoom and lovely reading through all of your discussion posts. It's just been fantastic. All right, take care.